What's going on guys? GeoSnow right here. So in today's video I have great news for 32-bit devices and especially for the iPhone 4S. Cool Booter, an application that is used for dual booting on a jailbroken 32-bit device, has been updated and is now supporting fully the iPhone 4S. Now uh, this, is, um, this is their Twitter and they have posted um, yesterday that Cool Booter, the application, uh, the version 1.0 beta 10 is now available via their repo on coolbooter.com. This is the address you need to add in Cydia. And the changes are iPhone 4 is, is now fully supported. Now, uh, if, you, if you remember, Coolbooter has been threatened to be uh, discontinued at some point. I'm really glad that the author behind it decided uh, to continue the uh, development of it, so that's pretty cool. Now, uh, in order to explain Coolbooter properly for those of you who are not uh, aware of it, it basically makes the process of dual booting a 32-bit device way easier than it used to be. Now, in the past, if you wanted to dual boot your device, your 32-bit device, for example, an iPhone 4 on uh, jailbroken, you had to, you know, um, create a partition yourself to patch the things yourself and so on, which was very, very hard. There were tutorials um, posted by Shadow Lee, another developer, but they were hard to um, they were hard to follow. This application here does everything automatically. You just install it on a compatible device, select the version you want to go on, uh, and you're good to go. So what it does, as I say, Cool Booter allows you, for example, on, on an iPhone 4 to have iOS 7.1.2 that is currently signed, jailbroken, and also dual boot with iOS 6.1. Whatever. So this is pretty interesting, and you just switch between them and allows you to use iOS 6 fully working and even jailbroken. Uh, this is not compatible with 64-bit devices because the uh, the tool that is being used in uh, in the background is not compatible. It's, uh, it's definitely not compatible with 64-bit devices and therefore you cannot use it on 64-bit. I'm going to show you on a device how it looks like and how to install it from Cydia, so be right back. So um, yeah, I do not have a uh, jailbroken 32-bit device, but I'm going to show you on my iPhone 6. After you install it, this is how it looks like. I'm going to have this icon. Again, it's not compatible with 64-bit devices. This means iPhone 5s and up, it's not compatible. iPhone 5 and lower are compatible. And of course, the application looks like this. You click install. It's going to ask you which version you want to install. Of course, it's going to de detect the device automatically. And it's going to download the IPSW, do the patching in the background, and then you're, you're going to get this boot button uh, enabled. And in order to, to switch, for example, from iOS 7.1.2 or from iOS 9.3.4 to iOS 8 or to iOS 6, you're going to just need to press um, the button here, click boot, and you're going to restart the device. It's going to ask you to turn off the screen to lock the device. and. Um, yeah, it's going to be pretty easy to to, to boot into it. Now, uh, I made a video in, uh, in uh, I think, in February, so I'm going to link it in the description down below to, um, to let you know more about how you can use it. Anyways, this is how you get it working. It's Cool Booter Beta, keep in mind. And uh, the uh, source in order to add it is this one in here, coolbooter.com. After you add it, you're going to have on system, Cool Booter Beta and Cool Booter CLI. You're going to click Cool Booter Beta and you're going to install it. Again, keep in mind only jailbroken and only 32 bit devices. And then you're going to have the application on your screen, which is going to perform all the things. So uh, you can also uninstall the, um, the iOS version, the secondary iOS version, if you want to. And for example, you no longer need a um, dual boot. You can simply do that, you can simply remove it after that. So uh, this is actually it, I really hope it's going to, uh, to help you a lot. If you have an iPhone 4S and it's jailbroken, definitely try this out. Keep in mind it's a beta and peace out.